Hello, everybody. This is another edition of Vanessa's Journeys. I know that we just connected, but that was more of a financial connection. Um, now I wanted to update you on what's going on with ministry. Um, as a church, we had a personal quarantine because many of the families uh, tested, uh, many of our families tested positive with COVID. Um, and so we were on a lockdown uh, with a personal church quarantine. And then as everybody was getting better, the government put us on a quarantine. So we've had quarantine upon quarantine. And so that makes things a little difficult. However, as a church, we are looking into ways that we can connect with each other, um, whether that's through Zoom, uh, messaging each other, calling each other, going on walks, um, having somebody over just one-on-one, -on -one, just creative ways that we can, can still connect with the community. Because during the Christmas season, not just during the Christmas season, but just any time, um, when you're alone, um, that depression can fall on you and you can feel just alone. Nobody loves me, uh, who I am, who am I, and that sort of thing. And we don't want anybody to feel like that. Like that. We want to continue to love each other as Christ has loved us. And so we're looking to ways of how can we do that? Um, and uh, how does that look within our church community? So can you be praying for that for us, please? Um, as for me, um, I'm still doing Village twice a week, Tuesdays and Thursdays. And I still have Slayava once a month, as well as the English courses near me. Because December is coming, that means the semester is about to end. Um, and so for me in the village, that means that um, I am finishing out uh, books uh, so that the children will be done with that certain book before the holidays. Um, and I am finishing um, testing and all that sort of stuff. Uh, you can be praying because there's rumors out there that the government is going to put us on another more strict uh, lockdown, just as they have done with you guys uh, in America and elsewhere uh, over the holidays. But they're talking about extending that through the month of February, which means that I may not be able to be back to the village until March, which means that my kiddos may be without lesson for at least a couple of three months, which means that I myself am looking into a way that I can uh, still uh, teach uh, the kiddos in the village uh, through the internet, whether that's through Zoom or through an English portal or something like that. Um, but that means getting them all registered and making sure that, that everybody has it. It's a little difficult because many kids just have phones. They don't have a tablet. They don't have a computer. Uh, all they have is a phone. So we're trying to connect in a way that is uh, phone sensitive, you might say. Um, so I'll be praying for that, please, as I'm trying to figure all this out. Um, and as Christmas rolls around, um, we as a church are going to be reaching out to our community, uh, kind of with a, a shoebox, Meredith's purse kind of thing. We've been gathering clothes, uh, hygiene items, uh, toys, candy uh, to give out to the kids during this year um, and to the families around us. Uh, so be praying for that as we... Uh, gathering all the last minute stuff and we'll be wrapping it up in the shoe boxes and we are excited to be able to give those out to the kiddos and to the community around us um and uh the car is as you may or may not know is working um sort of uh there's times when it starts and there's times when i have to give it just a little bit of encouragement to get it going um, but thankfully, I've been able to get uh, back and forth to my ministry needs uh, without it shutting down on me midway. Uh, so God has been very gracious and I'm very, very thankful. Um, please be praying for a more a reliable car. I have $2,000 saved up for that. And I'm looking at a three to uh, $4,000 uh, uh, benchmark. That's what I'm looking at saving up. If you want to donate towards that, that information is down below. I'd be very, very thankful. Please drop me a note if you have donated so that I know that it's not regular uh, support, but I know that this support is specifically for the car. Um, another thing is that, as you remember from my last update, our financial update, as you might say, uh, my home church is changing, has changed the way that they are accepting uh, the support checks, uh, not the support, the support finances and the way that support checks go out, um, which means that if you have not sent your support in for December, uh, it needs to be into the Calvary Fellowship office by the end of this month. Um, that means you have like just a few more days. Uh, so if you've not put your check in the mail already, you might want to do that. Or <laughs> you might want to do that um, because the cutoff date is the 30th. Uh, uh, the cutoff date is now uh, the last day of each month. 
Um, and so I'll be getting uh, my check on the 10th, and that'll cover December. So that'll cover rent, uh, utilities, uh, gas for the car, um, food, and all that that I need for the month of December. Um, so just maybe make a note wherever you make notes that uh, Vanessa's support needs to be in by the end of the month. <laughs> I don't know how you do it. I make notes on my phone. Um, but then I forget to look at those notes. So then I make notes and they're all over my desk and all over. Anyway, just just a small reminder. Okay, so that's about it for me. Um, I'm praying for all of you guys, and I'm very thankful for all of you, uh, your support, your love, your encouragement. Um, it's been it's been awesome. We've had a year of it's been a tumultuous year, um, and it's not over. The year's not over yet, but I just want to say thank you. Um, and when I was sitting and and thinking yesterday about uh, things to give thanks for, you all first came to my mind. Um, so God bless you. And, and, and thank you again. And if you have any prayer requests, send them on email. Drop me a line on Messenger, uh, Facebook Messenger, or Instagram messages. Uh, those are the ones that I check the most often. And I would love to pray for you. If you have praise even, I'd love to sing your praises with you. Um, you drop those as well. So thank you all so much. God bless you. Enjoy your Thanksgiving. Enjoy your day off from Thanksgiving um, and the time that you're spending uh, with family or just relaxing. Um, God bless you all, and I will see you again uh, before Christmas. Goodbye. Love you. Bye. Mwah.